Hey, in this video, I'm going to show you guys a bunch of things you can do with Avalanche. I'm going to show you how to use Avalanche with MetaMask, how to swap tokens, how to bridge tokens, and all of that great stuff. So Avalanche boasting to be the quickest smart contract platform. Um, there's a bunch of things you can do with it. Blazing fast, low cost, and eco-friendly. Let's see how it differs um, with a lot of the major coins you know right now. Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Polkadot. So basically, Avalanche is quicker it's smarter, it's cheaper, and it's more efficient. So you can build the dApps, um, and there's a bunch of things in the ecosystem that we can start using right now. So let's go ahead and do that. You can come into uh, ecosystem right here, and then you can see that there's so many incentives right now. So look at this, Aave, bring $20 million in AVAX incentives coming soon. So you can check out their whole ecosystem here all of the tools that you need like exchanges, bridges, and all that great stuff. So you can see all of uh, the incentives coming right now. So Curve, 7 million in AVAX rewards, 15 million in combined incentives from Sushi coming soon. You have Trader Joe right here, 20 million in AVAX and Joe rewards. Trader Joe is like Uniswap for Ethereum. This is like Avalanche's major exchange, very popular. So we're going to actually go to Trader Joe and we're going to make a swap. So you can come to projects right here and then you can check out their ecosystem. You can submit your project if you have one. So we'll go to exchanges. So you can see Curve, Pangolin, SushiSwap, Trader Joe, Binance, Bitmart, Bitfinex, and Bitpanda. So Trader Joe. Um, before we connect our wallet, we have our MetaMask right here. So I have a video on how to, you know, install MetaMask and all of that great stuff. Before we move forward, you probably noticed we are on the Ethereum network. So I'm going to show you guys this website right here. It's chainlist.org as you see it. Chainlist.org allows you to find different chains um, for your MetaMask. So let's search Avalanche. Uh, you can see Avalanche right here. Let's connect our wallet, connecting the wallet. And now let's add this to MetaMask. So we have now added the uh, Avalanche network to our MetaMask and we have actually um, tra changed to that network. And you can see I just need to connect my MetaMask. So we've connected our, web, uh, our wallet to uh, Trader Joe and you can see we're on the Avalanche network. So as easy as that. And now we can trade. We just need some AVEX. So a great way to get AVEX is just buying it on Binance and then sending it over here. So give me a few seconds and I'll send over some AVEX. Okay, so I've transferred a little bit of AVEX to my wallet and we are ready to rock. So we're on Trader Joe and you can see here you can trade, pool, farm, land, stake. So let's do a quick swap together. We're going to do 0 0.4. Uh, let's do 0 0.1 AVAX. So about $9 into USDT. We'll do that swap and check out how cheap it is compared to an Ethereum transaction. You're paying 0 0.000038 uh, of an AVAX, um, which is dirt cheap compared to hundreds of dollars on the Ethereum network and it's a lot quicker as well. So we've just made our first swap um, into USDT. Let's make another swap. So this is Joe, Trader Joe. Let's buy some of those tokens and then let's actually stake that. So here's Joe right here. We are going to uh, do 0 0.1. I think we need to wait for the other transaction. Okay, good to go. So we are going to get 3.4 uh, Joes, which is cool. So let's make that swap as well. Very cheap gas, perfect. So we've now purchased some Joe with AVAX as well. And as soon as this transaction is completed, we're gonna go and stake that. Okay, perfect. So let's go and stake. So we're gonna earn more Joe with what we have right now. So for every swap on Joe, a 0.05% fee is collected to X Joe and use to buy back Joe tokens. Stake your Joe for X Joe. So staking APR is approximately 39%. So we have, maybe we need to refresh this because we have some Joe. Okay, cool. We have 3.42 Joe. We need to approve this contract, 11 cents, dirt cheap, and then we're going to start staking our Joe. And I'm going to come back in 10 years and I'm going to be a multi-millionaire. 
um, with a few dollars that I, I, I have right here. That's the goal. So we'll go ahead, we'll wait this to, we'll wait for this to approve and then we'll start staking awesome. So then we'll start staking our uh, Joe. So I may have to refresh that again or okay, perfect stake. And let's go and get this staked. So perfect. Now, as soon as that clears up, I am now staking my Joe tokens for, for approximately 38.9, so pretty much 39%. And it was dirt cheap. There's so many incentives and, and liquidity coming to Avalanche from different protocols right now, like we saw um, Aave, Curve, and there's so much uh, different contracts or you know APYs that you can earn by just finding the right uh, protocol. I mean, just by looking at everything they have to offer. So we are now staked. You can see right here, stake Joe, X Joe balance, and that will start uh, accumulating for me in the back now. I don't have to do anything. So as easy as that. Let's keep moving forward. We are going to buy some more USDT. Actually, we have 55 USDT, so that's perfect. Let's go back to the ecosystem. But before we do that, actually, I'm gonna show you guys where to find more Avalanche Avalanche ecosystem coins. So you come to CoinGecko, you come to coins, you go to categories, and then you go to Avalanche right here. Avalanche ecosystem coins by market cap. So then you can see um, all of the coins you can find on Joe, and there you have it, Joe right there. And then you can look at coins that are just on the Avalanche network because those might be trending or you might be thinking that's the future. Those coins are gonna do very well. So let's take a look at some right now and then we'll just pick a random one to buy. So this one is down 20% in the day. Maybe it will rebound. Avalanche uh, AVEX launcher. I'm actually familiar with that one. Uh, so AVEX launcher, it's down 20%. We just come here, we take the Avalanche uh, contract, we copy and paste that. We go back to Trader Joe now. We go to USDT, this right here. We copy and paste the address, and then you can see that the token here, we can actually add it. So that's Avalanche Launcher. We've added the token, and now we are going to purchase some. So 0 0.01, actually we'll just buy a little bit. So we're getting 313 tokens, and as easy as that, we found the contract address. That's a great way to verify that's the right contract address so you don't get scammed, and that's a great way to find tokens by going to CoinGecko, uh, and I'll show you guys one more time, going to Categories, and then looking for that Avalanche ecosystem or whatever ecosystem you're looking for specifically. So that trade is being verified, um, it's being finished up on Trader Joe right now, and we just got ourselves uh, some AVEX launcher tokens. Awesome. So let's keep moving forward and we're going to go back to the ecosystem right here. So um, a bunch of things going down on Avalanche right now. We want to bridge. So what is bridging? Right now that if we go back to Chainlist, you saw there's a bunch of different networks here. There's a bunch of different networks. Um, and when you have your tokens on one network, you need to be able to bring them from one network to the other. So for example, the Avalanche network to the Ethereum network. And by doing that, we need to use a bridge. And we will use a bridge recommended to us on the ecosystem, which is bridge.avax.network. We will need to connect our MetaMask wallet, which is standard, so we'll connect our MetaMask wallet. And then we are bridging from the Avalanche network to the Ethereum network. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to do USDT, $55 USDT we have. We're gonna go maximum. Oof, the max is $152 is the max that we need. I'll send a little bit more funds from Binance. We'll do another trade and then we'll make this transaction happen. We'll bridge from the Avalanche network to the Ethereum network. Okay, so we got more AVEX. They're making us do a minimum. So let's go back to Trader Joe and we'll show these guys what's up. We'll take our AVEX right here. Um, we have a little bit more than that. so. Maybe we'll refresh this. We'll go to trade. Okay, awesome. 
we need 150 um, minimum. We already have 50 bucks. So let's just do 125. So awesome. We're going to do a quick swap. You can see how quick that is. So 125 bucks in AVAX to USDT. So now we have the minimum amount needed to do the uh, to do the bridge. So we are bridging a hundred and what was it? $75. I think we need to wait for the transaction to finish up. We'll bridge the total we have in USDT from the Avalanche network to the Ethereum network. And then um, we're pretty much done. So it's taking a little bit of time for the transaction to finish and it just finished up. So let's go back here. We'll refresh this as well. So awesome, We let's do USDT, $180 in USDT to the Ethereum network, back to the expensive network, so confirmed, and then you can see. So $180 in USDT, it is now being confirmed on the Avalanche network and then being sent to the Ethereum network. So I'll let this finish up and then I'll show it to you guys on the Ethereum side. Awesome, so that was six seconds on the Avalanche side and then about a minute on the Ethereum side. So let's check out if we actually got that. We will go to the Ethereum network right here and that was USDT. So let's go and import tokens and let's search USDT and Perfect. We have $131. They taxed us from $180. I mean, but the fees are pretty gross uh, anywhere you go. So uh, you can see as easy as that. I showed you guys how to add the Avalanche network to your MetaMask, actually any network to your MetaMask. I show you guys how to find different projects on their ecosystem from going to ecosystem.avex.network or you can go to CoinGecko and look by categories and then look by any ecosystem, any blockchain that you want to. I showed you guys how to do a swap on Trader Joe, how to stake your Joe and you can go to any other protocol and stake, farm, lend and then I showed you guys how to bridge from the Avalanche network back to the Ethereum network. So if you guys have any questions, Post them below, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.